Breaking news tonight, thousands of cruise ship passengers are back on dry land and in New Jersey tonight after a vacation they will never forget. Their cruise ship sailed right into a storm and experts say they are lucky they made it out of the bad weather alive. Free at last, free at last. Our Royal Caribbean's Anthem of the Seas is finally back in New Jersey after a rough ride. I'm glad to be home. I'm not going to hold it against them. I'm just never going to cruise again. This is what passengers faced 30 to 50 foot waves, 150 mile per hour winds, and inside, not much better. Oh my God. The ship was forced to make a U turn one day after setting sail. Passengers felt trapped. You could hear the waves crashing against the hull metal twisting and banging all night long. It was scary. The ship left the New York area on Saturday heading to Florida when it got stuck in a storm. Passenger video shows the scary scene inside when they were ordered back into their cabins. At one point people were falling over and they said, you know, you know, hold hold the wheelchair. Um, so myself and others were, you know, standing over holding the, the wheelchair so they weren't going to be sliding around. That's a full blown major storm. Captain Bill Doherty is a former cruise line captain and a Navy veteran. He tells us the cruise liner never should have left New York in the first place and Royal Caribbean should have known better. He says they put thousands of lives at risk. To put a ship 18 decks high with 7,000 people in the middle of that when you had a choice not to was in my opinion not the right decision to make. And most of the passengers agree they're just getting off the ship right now, and they all say it was horrifying. Meantime, Royal Caribbean says four passengers reported minor injuries, and the ship sustained some damage to its public areas and staterooms. Passengers will get a full refund and a certificate towards 50% off of a future cruise, if they ever want to go again. Kate, thank you.